so good. They sent me a package. I can bring this everywhere next time when I'm like shopping for clothes. I think I'll be okay. Afternoon. It's one o'clock. Okay, technically I didn't wake up late. I woke up at like seven, but then I slept till nine. I just didn't want to go out. My face is so bad right now. Can taste stuff, and I'm gonna eat my leftover food. Oh, I have the leftover bun from yesterday. They literally refill the snack. Yeah, you see that fridge right there? They put like little drinks in there and then like you see that little snack guy? They put snacks there and literally grab them. Okay, who knows? Maybe when it's at night, I'll feel like going out and do some stuff. This is my sort of heaven, okay? I can't taste stuff, guys. Like I need a sniff. Okay, my right turn. There's literally a family mart downstairs. Life is so convenient. If I know how to call takeout, I would never be leaving my room, ever. Ever, 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 ever. It's just so like pretty. And then there's me. Hey, hey, hey. Don't be fucking rude. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> oh, I'm so dirty. <laughs> you guys see me at my worst. It's fine. We just got our nails done. It's a clear type of thing. But the thing was that they only took cash and I'm like $300 short and they were like, no, it's fine. And I forgot to bring my cards because I'm just like, I have Apple Pay. We're gonna withdraw some cash. And you guys saw how that was a nightmare for me before. And so we're gonna go to a family mark since it's closest to us. I'm really hoping they take the card because if not, I'm gonna literally fucking cry. Is it gonna take my card? Oh wait, I think I might take my card. Is it gonna work? <gasps> Um, oh my god, guys, I went through. like stores on the side because I thought they're usually just on like the streets at stands but I could be fucking wrong. Also guys I booked my color analysis on Monday. We stayed in again and this time I literally bought a huge bag of um, convenience food. I feel I'm lucky becoming like a family more expert. I can't find the room. I was outside and I didn't know where it was. And then the hair small lady, she was like, it's upstairs. This is the storage and I came up, up from here. This is where I came from, by the way. I want you to know how I feel. Though I may say it, I just think that I might have to spell it out for you. So
Autumn Warm is my best palette. She did say like, of course like not all the colors within like the season palette will like fit you. But she said mainly Autumn Warm and my second best palette is like Summer. And she said how like white gold looks best on me. Yeah, and apparently the outfit I was wearing today is more like a summer palette. I did this very last minute. They have a place in Taipei and another in Taichung. Right now we're going to go on the high speed rail. We're going to Kaohsiung. I want to go eat first. I am really hungry. So embarrassing. I went and I asked, I was like, well, where do I get it? I don't I don't know what to do. Okay, I think I get six. Oh my god. And where do you how do you light it? Do you just do you just um just have some idea? Oh he just ignored me. Oh I'm so confused. So basically I didn't get to record everything. You have to throw like these this thing. And if it doesn't land like one up, one down three times in a row, you have to redo it. And it only took me three tries and I got number 38. The guy told me that what this means is just that um I should always be like in the middle with things. An old lady who was helping me through this, she was so sweet. No, when I went in, you saw me, I was so self-conscious. Because I was like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. market that I wanted to come to, it's closed today. I think it's closed on Monday and Wednesday. It's okay. We're just gonna go back to that little mall place. Do you see those shops over there? I wanna go over there. Yeah, Taiwan makes me feel really safe. It's turning it's eight right now. I kinda regret booking my train at 10.55. I completely forgot about my journal. I need to go buy a journal. Yeah, we're gonna go up one more floor. It's here, Muji. I found it. Oh my god, they have like this tinier size. I never knew that. Or should I get a tinier one? Because I'm only going to be used over traveling. I'm going to get this size. Should I get a black one? So it's like a little different from my usual one. Oh wait, no, these are... Oh, these are blanks. Never mind. Let's get a pen. What pen should we get? I'm going to get a navy. Yeah, let's get a navy. Yep, this is great. I got the ticket for 9.05, so. This is us, this is where we're getting on. It's already here, oh my god. It leaves at 9.05, it's currently 8.58. Last official day in Taiwan, and I'm dressed like a little grandma again. How could I? Guys, I'm currently at the temple. I'm gonna walk up there. Yeah, there's just something about temples these days, guys. I guess I'm just like geared towards places that are quieter. Oh my god, people have carts. I had to take off the sweater because it's getting a little hot. I didn't go on a Stairmaster for nothing. Oh my god, 
there's like, are those, oh my gosh, there's little butterflies. Guys, remember when I got my color analysis done? They sent me a package. It's a mini little version of the color analysis thing. Oh my god, it's so freaking cute. It's tiny. I can bring this everywhere next time when I'm like shopping for clothes. But I really want to invest in something like this, this color. It grew on me the more I looked at it. Yeah, I'm so happy with this thing. And also they gave me like a little pamphlet, the colors that will look good on me, which I'm really excited for. I have a little chit chat session, okay? Just you and I, talk to talk. I feel like not many people talk about this for solo traveling. Yeah, I get fucking lonely. Sometimes like you just, sometimes you're just like, you're anxious and then you're like, oh, I feel bad for you being anxious. It's a domino effect. Um, for those who've seen like that fucking first video, like the first day in Taipei, I was so anxious. I was like, I cannot fucking do this. There is no fucking way I can do this. It's been two weeks. I feel a lot better. I think what it just really matters for me is just like for me to feel more familiar with the place. There was just a lot of familiarizing myself with stuff and like, you know, but this trip just, it really just shows me that I'm very capable of doing things by myself. I, I get fucking anxious, okay? Like, anyways, let's see how Tokyo fucking goes. I'm so fucking anxious. Oh my god. I think I'll be okay. Yeah. And our train is at 9. That'll bring us to the Taoyuan airport. And our flight is at 1. Okay. I think we're good. I think we're on time. We're gonna go downstairs and check out now. Guys, we successfully checked in. I'm so happy. It actually went by very smoothly and the line was not long. The airport is so beautiful. My checked in bag wasn't overweight. This is like automatic coffee machine. That's so cool. C6. That's where we're gonna be. I didn't see any bakery I like, but this is my Americano.